So over the past month, I've done two things differently when it comes to posting videos on Instagram. One I already taught you guys in my last Instagram tutorial, which if you haven't seen that yet, go ahead and check it out, link in description. But the second strategy is adding captions and a progress bar in every video that I've done in the past month that has dialogue. And a lot of you have actually noticed that, wondering how I'm adding these captions and how I'm editing this progress bar. Well, guess what? This tool that I'm about to show you today, I'm not editing anything. I'm literally just clicking buttons. And the results of this tool have been super, like it, I just can't explain how crazy this has been. This app is called Zubtitles and this app is actually sponsoring this video. So thank you Zubtitles, more on them later. Let me show you what this thing does though. So let's jump into my computer now and I will show you all the magic that you can do with Zubtitles. Now it's not an editing tool. The way it works is you create your edit then export it out of your software, whatever you're using, Final Cut, Premiere, doesn't matter. And then you import your video into Zubtitle. So the way that works is I'll go ahead and add new video. You can either click or drag into there, but I'll just choose a video here. So at this point, what it does is it extracts the audio and it transcribes all your dialogue pretty accurately, I may say. One of the things I love about Zubtitle is it supports 4K quality videos at H.264 codec, which is awesome because that's what I use. Once it uploads, it goes into the caption editor. At this point, all you'll do is make sure everything is correct. The AI is also impressive because not only is it accurate, but it even picks up the best places to add lines in and even some inflection in our voices where it'll start with a period and then a capital letter. So you'll go ahead and edit whatever it may not have picked up depending on the quality of your audio it picks up everything for this one here i don't have to change a thing which is awesome now i'll go to style video and here you'll have caption styles which it gives you a bunch of default ones but you can also customize one to your liking and save it so for this one it's ig 4x5 that is my custom preset i already created that once and that's it so let me show you how i do that so i'll go here to manage fonts and then add new style so for your template, it gives you several options to choose from. If you have a 16 by nine video, a square video at one by one or nine by 16, which is full vert, so vertical video for IGTV, this is what you'll use. Now for four by five videos, vertical for IGTV feed videos, what I would recommend is using the preview size of one by one. I wish four by five was in the preview size. I'll let them know about that, but one by one works just as well. You can choose from over 200 plus fonts, which is awesome. So I just chose the Roboto because I use that for a lot of my branding in my videos. You can change text size to your liking, as you see here, the color of text to whatever it is you're using. For this example, so we can really see it, I'll just choose that green and then I'll choose the text color of black. And you can even provide text outline. So let's choose white and then let's use the outline. You even provide shadow as well. So it's pretty endless what you can do in editing your captions. Let's say I wanna use that. I'll go ahead and hit save. And there you go, now it's saved. So let's go back to my video. I'll then choose the template that I just made. And there we go. And another thing you can do is finely tune where your captions go within the frame. So I will select fine tune, and then I can just drag this little bar here to control exactly where I want this to go. Since I already have headlines that I created in Final Cut, I don't need to use the other feature, which we'll talk about. So let's say you don't add your own headlines within Final Cut or Premiere. You can do that in Zubtitle. Now, one of the greatest parts about Zubtitle is it works with all the primary aspect ratios for Instagram. The best part though, is it even formats these for you. So let's take a new video here. And this is a 16 by nine shot video, as you can see. Let's go to style. And you can see that this video can become a square video if need be. It can also even be a four x five video, depending on the lens you use. This was just shot with my phone. But if you have a phone or obviously a camera that has a wide angle lens, then you're totally good to go. And this will work super dope. Just for that, you gotta smash the like button. I mean, that's dope, time saver for sure. So let's start by doing this. I wanna change this to a four x five video and I wanna add a headline. What I'll start by doing is I'll zoom just a teeny bit. That way it's a little bit bigger vertically. I'll click add headline. So let's title it. I can even choose any one of the style caption options. Let's go with that, a focused headline. I can even change the background color to anything from my branding. Well, you know, I'm a teal and orange guy. So let's, uh, yeah, there we go. 
Let's zoom in my video just a little more to where it matches the headline. I'll add the caption and boom, we're good to go in that regard. So if you've ever wondered how people do this, subtitle is one of the ways that this happens. I can do all this in editing with Final Cut Pro, but it'll take me quadruple the amount of time, especially because I have to type every single line that I'm saying. Uh-uh, I'm not into that. The next thing I'm gonna add is the progress bar, which is super awesome because again, Yes, you can replicate this in post, but it still takes time versus hitting a button like the like button. So let's hit add progress bar and it appears on the bottom. Now what I can do at that point is change the colors to match my little scheme here. I'll choose black for the background and then let's choose a different shade of blue for the foreground, something like that. That looks okay. And then you can see from start to finish how it works. Let's hit play and look at this real quick. So there you go, you get the point. Now the last thing we can do is add another new feature that they added. The progress bar is a new feature that just rolled out and the logo is the other feature that just rolled out. The greatest part about all this is my caption is now saved for future use so I can use it and just pop it on. And my headline is also saved so I can use those for future videos. The only thing I would have to add is the progress bar and the logo if you wanted it. Everything that I just showed you right now would probably take me up to 20 minutes for a one minute video, whereas what I just did took me five minutes. Like it literally just took me five minutes. I even timed everything that I did step by step and that's the amount of time that it took me. Now, let me go to my last video, the real video I'm gonna use. I'm gonna go ahead and export this out simply by going to the download tab and hitting render and download. Subtitle works on a balanced subscription, so my account only has 10 videos a month. So it shows you here how many will be deducted. So looks like I gotta wait till next month to do another one. We'll go over pricing and the awesome discount Subtitle has given to you in a second. Once it's finished, you can simply click here to download the final product so you can upload it to Instagram, airdrop it to your phone or email it to yourself or use Creator Studio to upload your video from your desktop. Now, are there any downside to using Subtitle? I honestly didn't really find much and I've been using this tool for over a month now. There is a maximum file size of less than a gigabyte. That is not that big of a deal. But let's say we have an IGTV video that's over a gig, which does occur. That's a bummer. Now that you've seen all the magic Zubtitle can do for your Instagram content, let's talk about how you can try this out for yourself. If you use the link in the description and sign up for Zubtitle, you'll be able to try it free for one video. And then once you fall in love with it, because I guarantee you, you will, you can use this code to get 50% off of your first month subscription. And yes, I will also provide that code in the description below. Thanks a ton to Zubtitle for sponsoring this video and giving us a dope discount. And for more Instagram and IGTV tutorials, crush that subscribe button, like this video if it helped you out, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram, DM me, let's connect and I my beautiful vert friends will see you on the next one I'm out